Hey guys, it's another month of short part four. It is February, 2024. Sadly, this will be my last month of doing these reviews. Um, the company has gotten real shady lately and uh, did some things that um, I don't wanna support them anymore by um, promoting their product. So just to give you some heads up on, uh, I think you saw, I think it was last month, um, they sent me the wrong size pants. And how they do is the mulligan is you send it back and they give you points in your account. Well. What they've done now is they've devalued the points in your account. So if you get referrals, if you do returns, they give points. And now they've taken the value of those points and cut them all in half. So out of the blue, just all your points were just cut in half in their value. Um, the other thing they did that was super shady is you used to be able to use those points to purchase anything you, did, you wanted in their vault store. And uh, now they've created a separate store of just their items. Um, so the Graham Lux, the 1764, um, predominant, predominantly those two uh, product lines. So um, they're forcing you to buy their things. Um, over the past year, have, have you seen on these reviews, it's gone from a really sort of fun thing where you were getting all different types of brands where they're now forcing you to just, every month you just get their brands. Um, and they've added some other ones, like they've added the Stroll Shoes, uh, they added the uh, the Shaft and Balls is their brand, and then um, I think there's like a different like one that's for outerwear. Um, so anyway, super disappointing. I contacted customer service; they couldn't have been uh, less friendly about it and accommodating. Um, and uh, I just feel it's shady behavior. And again, I've been disappointed that we haven't been getting different brands besides their own brands. And I get it; it's a, it's all attempt to to cut their costs, but it's really not helping uh, the customer. Um, again, so uh, I, I don't think I'm going to continue anymore with this, and uh, I'm sorry uh, that uh, it's it's gotten to this, but I'm sure I'm sure a bunch of you guys are feeling the same way. So anyway, sorry for that long diatribe to start. Uh, this will be the last bag that I'm opening for these guys. So uh, let's see what we get. This is the Fairway membership. All right, let's see what we got first. Oh, T. The T's which are just crappy plastic tees that they throw in there and looks like the bag opened so they went everywhere. All right, um, so I dig through more tees, loose tees in the bag. Uh, let's see, wine voucher you get every time. More tees. All right, let's see what we got first. Okay, so above the links, that was the other, the outerwear brand uh, that's also there. So again, we're not getting any, like like when we first started, when I first started this, if you go back to my older videos, we were getting Callaway, we were getting Travis Matthew, Adidas, uh, Under Armour. Now it's just all their stuff. Um, so um, let's see. This is says Gunmetal XL. Let's see what this is. Is this rain gear? All right, so these are, looks like gray uh, rain pants, which is nice. Um, and it says that the MSRP is $100. Again, on their things, the MSRP, they're setting the price themselves. So they're, so they're setting what the value is. Now, rain pants, is, I mean, $100, that's probably about right. But again, sort of, sort of shady how this has all turned. All right, so a nice pair of... Uh, Gray rain pants. And here is uh, above the links again. It says Navy. I don't know what this is. MSRP $70. This is a pair of sort of rain shorts. Um, I guess it's waterproof. Uh, rain shorts. Okay, sort of interesting. Um, definitely not material you would wear for every day. So I guess in that certain, if you were gonna go play in the rain and wanted to wear shorts, you would throw these on. Here's the what they say as the retail value. Um, let's see what else we got. And the poker chip. So it's a Valentine's theme. It's got Cupid holding a golf club, and then it says instant love on the back. 
So, um, I, you know, I will say for the, for the, the $55 plus shipping, um, getting a pair of rain pants and uh, rain shorts is, is good. Again, um, I just, how they've handled this whole situation and going forward and just knowing that they're not letting you pick anything out of their store, they're sort of like siphoning off certain products, probably the stuff they're trying to get rid of to use your points for, especially when they're the ones who sent me the wrong size pants. And now I'm forced to get those points devalued. Um, it just is bad business. And again, their customer service was terrible in how they handled it and made no effort uh, to try to help me. So again, it's been fun guys. Um, and uh, hopefully we'll meet again soon. Talk to you guys later. Bye.